I am honored to stand and present to you all Hospital 1633, and I ask the body to please be patient with me as we can take time to honor Native Americans across the state of Illinois. We appreciate uh, the state board reaching out, forming this, um, developing more of a partnership, uh, and looking for our input in terms of the resources and content uh, and, and direction of the uh, uh, kinds of education uh, that the children will receive. Nothing's ever talked about um, current Native people or peoples, uh, current tribal nations, and there is a need for it here in the state. I see it every day here at the museum with the schools that are coming in and the questions that they're asking um, are specifically about uh, today's Native people and they're asking about books, contemporary books, what books can they read, whose stories can they tell, what TV shows can they watch. Here in Chicago alone, we've got over 150 different tribal nations represented within our community. We want to be as inclusive as we can to tell the story of Native people, to let people know that we're not just one nation. The local part of it is going to include the removal stories of the tribal nations, because Illinois, again, has no federally recognized tribal lands. So we want to be able to reach out and work directly with um, the tribal nations that were removed from here. Another area that was uh, lacking was addressing the Native American genocide uh, uh, here um, uh, that, that, we, uh, that we experienced. So this bill brings it under that umbrella uh, so now the students will be able to uh, learn more of just what occurred with our tribal nations. In looking at the educators, part of what we had found is that they're teaching things that they learned when they were young and really had not been uh, enhanced uh, or, or challenged, uh, or they just haven't had time to, uh, to seek to delve into this further. My story is the same as kids coming through the Chicago public school systems or even any school system where we are usually the only native student in the school system, Native family in the school system. And um, anything that comes up Native in history classes or anything in the school as the only Native student, that student is usually looked at as being the expert or the one to teach the teachers in the entire class about a whole group of people. Most of them aren't even the tribal nations that are being talked about. This bill will be able to help um, the students and the families that, so that responsibility won't fall on them anymore. <laughs>